So how are we all doing tonight? Yeah, so just so you all know, yes, I do have a daughter. I'm not doing some like misguided porky pig impression like uh uh up here. Which is which is kind of funny because like a few years ago I, I didn't have a stutter until I bought this one like um improve your vocabulary C C C D like like I fell asleep to it and I guess it started to skip. Yeah. There it's like you know it was it, it, it's kind of funny when I was like around ages of six to nine I had had this one best friend and she was a girl and one year my dad got really pissed at me he said and pissed at me and he said. Boys play with boys and girls play with girls. Yeah, yeah, that's that's what he said. And I was kind of like, that kind of sucks. And, and then like a few years later, he came out as gay. So in his world, boys did play with boys and girls did play with girls. So that kind of like makes sense, just a little tiny bit. All right. <laughs> and uh, once I went on a date with this one girl and I asked her, hey, what's your favorite type, type of food to eat? And she said, I really like to eat date. And I just hightailed it the fuck out of there because I'm not a superficial man. I don't really have that many hang-ups, but I draw the line at cannibalism. All right. You know, I'm 41 years old. I lived a, a full life. Like once, like, um, like I, I, I stockpiled a bunch of dirt diapers in a eating bed. I, I once drag raced this, this one guy who was in a souped up wheelchair down a busy city street and I don't even have a license. And, and once, like, I tried to open up a rattlesnake pegging zoo, and I also done a lot of dumb things too. <laughs> and once, this one girl invited me up to her place to eat her pussy, and I was so eager to do it, so I came up to her place with knife and fork in hand, and she got really freaked out, and she was like, "What the fuck are you doing?" And, like I said, "I'm here to eat your pussy. What do you expect me to do it with my bare hands, like some goddamn barbarian? I have table manners, bitch." You know? Yeah, it's like, once like when I heard the, the term fracking, I thought it was slang term for masturbation. So when I heard like, when I read the headline that said, stop fracking in South Dakota, I thought there was some epidemic of poor dudes in South Dakota just like, cranking them away and you neglecting know, their like, personal responsibilities. Like, what if say, Henry, you haven't mowed the, the lawn in three months. It's like, shut up, you old witch, I'm, I'm fracking in here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I, I will never hump the stool in my act. Not because I think it's a hack thing to do. It's because I'm not, a sex, I'm not sexually attracted to stools. It's, it's all about preference. What I'm really into is girls with big noses. Yeah. Whenever I see a hot chick with a big nose sneeze, I'm, I'm, I'm always like, ooh, sneeze. A sneeze again, you big goddess. Yeah, and that's my time. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Stand-up heads might appreciate. Uh, when comics come up the stage, they're never the bottom. 